The ANC project is CreateX's latest technology, which provides an intelligent approach to radioactive waste management. It answers three main challenges. Number one, can we reduce the amount of nuclear waste produced and ultimately stored? Number two, can we remove people from the danger of the assessment of that waste? And number three, can we use digital tools to improve the workflow in the nuclear industry as a whole? In the UK alone, the lifetime disposal costs are estimated at over £18 billion. This equates to over £50,000 per cubic metre of intermediate level waste and £7,500 per cubic metre of low level waste. Therefore, there's a strong, strong driver to ensure that waste is, is, is accurately assayed and as much as possible of the waste is put into the, to the appropriate low level storage. Currently, waste items are assayed in a spot measurement manner. It's very, very difficult to, to determine the, the precise location of the radionuclides on the surface of, a, of an item. Therefore, that drives the industry to push waste into potentially a higher waste category, which increases handling costs uh, and, and increase lifetime disposal costs. The ANSI project aims to reduce those pessimisms by highly accurately assessing the, the activity of the waste item. So the process begins with the waste it then placed into the NC cell. The end of the robot uses the NC sensor pack, which can navigate the object and avoid collision. The scan generates upon cloud and radiometric data is collected. NDZ is then used to estimate the source distribution of the contamination of, on the object's surface. This is an existing, tried and tested technology deployed across the world. A 3D model combined with radiometric data is then ready to be used to plan decontamination activities. Operators can use this information to plan how waste will be dismantled, improving the effectiveness and cost of decontamination. ANC is a very modular system, so we have a manipulator arm and a sensor pack. The modularity means that the whole system can be modified to suit the specific needs of the particular application. Therefore, you don't need large custom mechanical structures in order to perform this assessment. As long as a robot can reach it, it can be surveyed.